these special Kiwis were born to build. And build, they shall. Because this is the moment they've been waiting for all their lives. Well, Blockaholics Rejoice, New Zealand's favourite DIY show is back. Season 7 of The Block NZ premiered last Sunday. And we're joined by two of this year's contestants, Ben and Tom. Welcome, guys. Yes, welcome. Um, so first of all, I must say, I've just been reading about you, Ben, oh. and um, people say that you are the spitting image of the guy who plays Ramsay Bolton on Game of Thrones. Yeah, I have. How do you feel about that? He's not a great character? No, he's not, actually. He's, he's, on the he's, contrary, he's a bit of a shocker. He is a great character. Just for all the wrong reasons. <laughs> yeah, he's like, probably the baddest of the bad on Game of Thrones if you don't watch it at all. Um, so how's it all going? Oh, great. Yeah, me and Tom really enjoying ourselves. Uh, so we just got into the swing of things, I think. But um, no sleep is definitely starting to destroy us a bit. <laughs> and did you, you know, because you, you knew each other from childhood, but did you know that each other was interested in DIY? Or, like, who applied and talked the other one into it? Oh, I think it was, it was pretty apparent early on. Ben um, has always been interested in architecture. He's always been into drawing things from a yeah. young age and uh, got me in the swing of things as well. I've always been sort of a little bit hands-on. and. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, it was easy as his mum was actually the one who, who commits us to apply. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Sandy. What did she say? What did she say? She said, oh, you'd be perfect. Give it a shot. And then we were like, oh. But then the friends got whiff of it, and then we were sort of, you know, forced into it. Well, because you were, because you were an architect graduate, so you should yeah. have the chops theoretically. You should have the experience mm. to do this really well. Theoretically, yeah. Is that going to play out for you, do you think? Uh, well, you know. Hopefully. Ho well, you know, they don't... That is a strange one, eh? Yeah, it's, it's, it's quite a lot different to the, the construction industry that we know. Uh, <laughs> they don't train me to match a rug with a pillow, that's for what? sure. So. You think TV's not real? It not really happens in the real world. I don't believe you. <laughs> no, these boys are... I watched, you know, the earlier weeks episode. They're not very good shoppers, but you know, <laughs> it's early days. We're just learning, boys. We are just learning. I, I want to quickly ask you though. We will find out eventually what is in that safe. That must mm. have been the most awkward start to the show. It was a tough one. <laughs> yep, I'm not a big fan of that sort of conflict, and we were in a, you know, rock, between a rock and a hard place there. So that for those who, who maybe aren't familiar with it, what happened? There was a safe, and there was a bit of argy bargy about the safe. Oh, there mm. was argy bargy, all right. Mm. Go well, by the way. Yeah, yeah go go well. well. <laughs> that was the initial plan. Obviously, we had the discussion about the rules of the, the safe and where we could search and whatnot, but um, there was no guidelines on who could search for it. So the first thing I did was run up to the builders and all the tradies and say, yeah. Go have, have a, a look. So, so they were all into it straight away, and yeah, Will was the one who found it. So we we thought we'd struck gold. Yeah. And yeah. the students not so happy about that, mm, No, <laughs> no, we were yeah, we were told that uh, yeah, Will, you know, did a bit of naughty pushing and stuff like that. So we were all like, oh no, maybe we should give it to them so we don't get in trouble. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we just watched the episode. It didn't look like quite quite like that, did it? <laughs> <laughs> Love it. And, and you know, is the safe going to, when we see what's inside the safe, is it going to change the game again? Or? Well, that's the, that's the key of these game changes. Oh, they tend wow. to change that game. <laughs> they just, um, Tom, what's Ben's most annoying habit so far? Most annoying oh. habit? I don't know. Okay, Ben, what's Tom's most annoying <laughs> habit? Oh, snoring for sure. It's just <laughs> hell in there. Yeah, mate, straight out for the count. He, it's incredible. As soon as he lies down, he's out. So I've got to then got 40 minutes of trying to block his snoring out before I can get well, to sleep. You, you have to be a big spoon and just kick him a few times. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Airplugs, apparently, they work. Okay, I've got some questions too after week one of season seven. Um, the McCaff that's there, yeah. do you get to eat like whatever you want and get coffees whenever you want or do they have rules? <laughs> oh, coffees are on tap. No um, way. Yeah, mm. it's amazing. Okay, cool. Um, how much help do you actually get when it comes to making the decisions on building? Because I wouldn't even know where to start. So how much help do you actually get? It really comes down to just our tradies and ourselves, really. We, we have the planning sessions with them and that's all we get. Yeah. There's, there's no one else really helping. So, so what about the other contestants? Who do you see as being the... I mean, obviously early days, but who do you see as being the biggest threat? It's tough to say. They've all got their, their um, yeah. advantages, each of the teams. Mm -hmm. Obviously, Amy and Stu, Stu's a tradie, so that's that's a little bit concerning. And um, the girls, they're both pretty pretty good eyes for design. Mm. And then Claire and Agni, they're dark horses. Yeah. Agni's got big ideas in that head of his. You can't, you can't ride off the dark horses either. No. In these sort of competitions, can you? Not at all. 
And have you sat back and watched any of the episodes so far? Because I know you're full on building at the moment. Yeah. But yeah, actually, have you sat down and watched? And what ran through your mind when it first came on telly? Yeah, we this did. Week? We took we took the time out to watch. So we watched the first two already. We watched it as a team. And man, pretty bizarre. Isn't it? <laughs> Do you watch yourself for the first time on TV like this? Yeah, the, <laughs> yeah. the whole way through. Hey, well, best of luck. I'm really looking forward to seeing how this um, all pans out. You're my favourite team so far, so you're going to win. Uh, you're the only team we've actually spoken to, but we try and get a little bit of sleep at least. You yeah, know? we will. <laughs> sleep. Our season seven on the block NZ screen Sundays at 7 pm, then Monday to Wednesday at 7:30 on three. Yeah, and if you want to catch up three now, is where you can do that.